time for my 27th John Carpenter game, Once Be a Millionaire, the Family Picture Edition for the DVD. Select either the adult or junior question here. Adult, please. <laughs> okay, you've chosen to answer the adult questions. There are 15 of them between you and a million pounds. Let's get you up to the first milestone as quickly as possible. Here is the first question for 100 pounds. Which the following event in fact the Winter Olympics? Breakdance, ice dance, tea dance, rain dance. Not be ice skating. That's right. Well done. Take a look at question two. It's for 200 quid. Which the following most likely to have HMS before its name? Tank, jeep, warship, fire plane. Not be a warship. It's the correct. The next question is worth 300 pounds. Here it comes. Corner saying, what's poured on troubled waters to calm things down? Forget, Petrol, no diesel, grease, oil. That'd be oil. Correct. Very well done. <laughs> What sport specifically describes themes ranged in historical date order? Horological, geological, sociological, chronological. Epic chronological. Well done, it's the correct answer. You are one question away from your first milestone. Get this right, and you'll be guaranteed a thousand pounds. When TC's mind, to whom did Arthur Day refer to as E indoors? His wife, his mother, his daughter, his cat. That be his wife. Congratulations, that is the right answer. You are doing very, very well. Great, you're guaranteed a check for a thousand pounds. But I don't want to give you that just yet. Let's shake things up a bit now by introducing a few pictures into the question. Brand new experience for this special Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Now you might as well play the next question. It's worth 2,000 quid. Which of these is a Victorian artist and designer best known for his wallpaper and fabric? William Wardergrove, William Wordsworth, William Gaunt, William Morris. That'd be William Morris. Excellent. You just won yourself 2,000 pounds. You're up to question seven. It's worth four thousand pounds. You don't have to play it, but here it comes. Which was this group's first UK top forty single? Rio, Girls on Film, Hungry Like a Wolf, Planet. Beat the Ranger and Planner. There's actually a slight variation of that in the second edition game about. Which group's first two guitar player was Planner of 1981, which happens to be Duran Duran. The next question is worth £8,000, but you will drop 3000 if you get it wrong. Here it comes. Which model Merseyside Village was built in the 1880s for the workers in a soap factory? Port Sunlight, Port Starlight, Port Moonlight, Port Daylight? I believe that would be Port Sunlight. I think it's 17th century, it's the um, Taj Mahal.
1975 film, which character played by Robert Shaw is eaten by a shark? Brody, Quint, Hooper, Paul. That'd be Quint. No problems with that answer. That's yeah, um, Spielberg and Shaw with uh, Jaws. And... Fantastic. I can now write you out a check for 32,000 pounds. <laughs> It's picture questions all the way now. You might as well have a go at question number 11 for £64,000. Here it comes. Hmm. In June 2002, who's the of this building to play God Save the Queen on his electric guitar? Mark Knopfler, Eric Clapton, Brian May, Francis Ross. Hey, Brian May was member Queen, so... Remember Queen, God Save the Queen. Fantastic, that is the correct answer. <laughs> uh, that one, if you don't know too much about which band you played, you probably might not get it right, though, so. This question is worth £125,000. There is no time limit. Here it comes. In which city is this tram running? London. Manchester, Glasgow, Sheffield. That would be um, Manchester. You didn't have to play that. <laughs> but it's just only £125,000. Right, you've done brilliantly to get this far. The next question is number 13 out of 15, and it's worth £250,000. We're talking about some huge sums of money here. So make sure you take your time and think carefully before you answer. Who was named chairman of the Mumble Nabas? After this man died in November 2004. Nabil Shah, Marwan Barghouti, Mahmoud Abbas. Baruch. Yeah, Mumble Abbas is here to Yasa F at the Palestine Liberation Organization. And I uh, believe Abbas actually is still the head of the PLO to this day, actually. Okay, you are now just two questions away from becoming a virtual millionaire. If you get this wrong, you will drop all the way back to 32,000. You're playing for serious amounts of money, so be very, very careful. Here comes question number 14. Okay. Which of the following Cuneiform is the bone. bone of the bones that make up this part of the human skeleton? Parietal bone, cuneiform bone, sphenoid bone, temporal bone. Now, cuneiform is part of the foot, not skull. You have just won half a million pounds. Congratulations, you have played a magnificent game so far. 14 questions correct, so just one more to win one million pounds. Now I've got to remind you that if you get it wrong, you would drop a mammoth 468,000 pounds. Hardly bears thinking about it. So here we go. The very, very best of luck. Okay, yeah. Which two successive Roman emperors erected this famous empire Thank you, Zoe. in the first century AD? Claudius and Nero, Tacitus and Florian, Trajan and Hadrian, Vespasian and Titus. It's Vespasian and Titus. Okay, let me just check. That is your final answer. I want you to be absolutely sure. Yes. You have. It's actually a thing you can actually hear if you get. The top price question and might or wrong, actually. If, if you tell if it's if it clicks you. early, then you got it right. It's if it right runs on a bit longer, you got it wrong. It's a weird technical glitch, I know. So. Holiday for you and your family. All of the 
instructions are on the screen. It really couldn't be simpler. Very well done. And thanks for playing the family picture edition of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Thanks for watching.